In this week's episode of Working with Evernote, it's about creating a hyperdoc. Hello and welcome to episode 61 of my Working with Evernote series and in this week's episode I want to show you how you can create a hyperdoc in Evernote. Now I think some of you are wondering what the what is a hyperdoc? Well a hyperdoc is essentially an interactive document uh, you can actually create this in Apple's pages or you can actually create it in uh, Microsoft Word but it's a document that has hyperlinks in it for a lot of teachers use it for additional materials for their students I certainly use it for my own learning programs and I'm going to show you an example of this in a moment in Evernote but essentially these documents can be are created using tables or you don't actually you don't actually have to create tables but you can actually create some very very beautiful documentations and Evernote gives you the power a lot of power that people don't actually realize Evernote has so today I want to show you how I've created a, a hyperdoc for my own personal learning uh, experience but you could of course if you're a teacher these are fantastic documents to use with your students if you're a consultant they're great documents for using with your clients and indeed if you're a business manager who's trying to coach their team you essentially only have to create one document and then share it with your team it's a really really useful tool and I'm going to show you how you can create it in Evernote using a few of the tricks that Evernote gives us that I discovered are a little bit hidden away so you might learn a few little tips and tricks that you can use in your own way today so let's get into this and I'll show you how this works so what I've done here is I've actually set up the um, <clears throat> the doc hyperdoc that I mentioned and what I've done is I'm taking Evan Carmichael's One Rule series. I love what he's done here and I'll just show you his YouTube channel. There are some amazing, this is a link to the playlist, Evan Carmichael's One Rule. Um, and there are, I think there's, over, there's about 80 videos. Yeah, there's 80 videos in there which actually talk, particularly in the last few episodes, he's got uh, some really really good like be grateful be competitive just do it seize opportunity push yourself there's some really good stuff here I was really impressed by the way with the work ethic video that he recently produced and I highly recommend that you watch that but there's some really really good stuff in here that I strongly recommend you have a look at and so what I thought I would do is for my university students who are uh, we're teaching a business creativity course we're trying to help them to become entrepreneurs um, what I wanted to do was create this hyperdoc so that they can use this as additional learning materials because we already have a book for them. And what we've done is I've got the video title here uh, in the left hand column. The middle column is the learning point that they need to learn and then the link directly to the actual video. So in this case the work ethic video is here and I've got that working a little bit harder work ethic very hard working go hard work ethic work work ethic hello believe nation my name is evan karma brilliant brilliant video i strongly recommend that you have a look at that it is fantastic video and it's only just over 15 minutes long so there's a link directly to those ones and i can then share this note with my students but as I said in the introduction, it's not just for university students or school kids or whatever. You can do this with your um, colleagues, your work friends, if you're a manager of a team and you want to give them uh, learning points to videos. And so what I've done is I created this table. Now, you're probably looking at it. We've got a color coded headline up here, the blue color coded, and then I've color coded the text down here and the links. So the links are pretty straightforward. You just copy and paste, but you create the table and then you create the thing. Now, let's say this is the end. Um, this is the end line. So all you have to do is control click. And what you find is down here, you've got table and it's fantastic table properties. So I can actually change the cell color so I can make that blue 
the cell color is going to be blue okay and it's changed the color to blue so I can actually um, do that for all those three ones down there and they can change the text so that the text is in white and it just looks very very clean and professional that's one way of doing that uh, as I've mentioned before and I think I don't know if I actually showed you this but the table properties is just a wonderful um, thing you surprising what you can find out in table properties so it's just control click in the square that you want table tables you've got all sorts of insert column insert row and a blah 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 and clicking on the table properties give you alignment text border colors you can make it bigger or smaller and you can tell the cell background some really really good little tricks that you can use in there but these hyperdocs are so useful because then all I need to do is share this document with whoever I want to share it with and I've got a, a document that's going to be help I can also add notes up at the top it's just a really really good way now I've seen this this week and I was looking for the note because I actually normally <laughs> I keep the note usually in here and unfortunately I don't think I've got it in here uh, maybe it's if I go into all my notes I probably actually did it for um, 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 yeah I got this idea actually from the Evernote um, blog and I was looking at this and I don't seem to be able to find it in my notes but anyway um, that's just one of those things that you can actually use it's not actually in there um, but it is a very very good um, way of creating documents that you can share with as many people as you want so as I say I can just bring this note up here and you can just expand it it looks really really good by the way on an iPad but it's such a brilliant way of being able to help your colleagues um, create things now I've seen people use this for their own exercise program they can find if you're doing like home exercise you can actually put a link to the video that you want to follow the routine that you follow in there you can actually put the, the details of what the exercise program is about it is such a good thing a way of taking full advantage of the things that you can use in Evernote and I really wanted to share that with you because I know how useful this can be and all it is essentially is just creating a table so I can go down there um, I can create a table in here uh, let's say we'll do a six by six so click that it creates a table six by six I can change the size of this table you can do all sorts if you want to add more you can just click on the option control tables and table properties and then you can go into here and do all sorts of things that you want so there's so many things that you really want to do um, I just find it's a wonderful tool that you can take use make use of in Evernote hopefully that's giving you some ideas of how you can use this hyperdocs a brilliant way of uh, teaching people new things linking to videos linking to articles you can do whatever you want so for you guys who are teaching out there for you guys who are managers of your own team and your part part of your work is to actually educate or continually educate your students or your work co-workers this is a really really good tool okay hopefully you found this useful don't forget guys this week we'll have seen the launch of my uh, complete guide to creating a successful life there'll be a link to the course in the notes section below and for you lucky guys who watch my episodes on YouTube I'm offering you all $90 off the list price of $140 so that you can get this course for $50 it's two and a half hours of video there's over 13 documents in there uh, additional materials there's so much involved in this course and it really really will help you to start creating a successful life for yourself so go out and check that out uh, it's up on Udemy you now and hopefully you will get so much out of that course thank you very much guys for watching this episode I really hope you've given you some ideas of what you can another way you can use Evernote and it just remains for me to wish you all an incredibly productive week